here is um, visual to help kind of give you some common sense understanding of this um, mechanism that he's talking about. Uh, look in pre-K and first grade and second grade. Maybe those children know by second grade several hundred words. By fourth grade, most good readers know about 4,000 words, according to Elfrida Hebert. Um, but by the end of high school, they may know 20, 30, 40,000 words or more. It's kind of hard to estimate. How could they have possibly learned all of those words by being explicitly taught? Cher says in the face of this orthographic avalanche, in other words, so many spellings um, and so many words to learn, direct instruction is unlikely to offer a feasible acquisition strategy. So he's not saying that we shouldn't teach our kids how to read. It's just that we're not responsible for every learn word that they learn. We need to give them the tools that enable them to read many, many words themselves. So here's what he says that children need to be able to self-teach themselves words. Rudimentary self-teaching depends on three factors, letter sound knowledge, basic phonemic awareness, and the ability to utilize contextual information to determine exact word pronunciations on the basis of partial decodings. So even when they haven't been taught something specific like a particular letter sound, they can still um, deduce the word if they have these skills working functionally.